Okay, I'm gonna do a quick uh, little uh, door review here. Here's the uh, the bug door. Here's my two little angle pieces that I installed here to hold the door popper. This is a 45 pound solenoid hooked to a bike cable that comes up over a pulley right here and goes over here and ties to the pull handle which is this. I popped this out with a, uh, a lug cutter so that I could get that clip on right there without having to fight like a madman. Over here is the window unit screwed in with four screws, solid as can be. The, the stem of this goes up in here behind this and it wraps around here with the right fittings. I used one inch spacers to back off the device from the, this to that so that I could have the crank handle recessed behind the door panel and everything back behind the door. Okay, now with my door uh, engineering pretty much finished, I need to start work on the uh, wiring all that up. I've got this uh, our little RF unit. It's like for auto lock RF unit. Uh, electric window controller, I got another one of these. Uh, various relays that I'm gonna have to hook up, switches, tons and tons and tons of stuff. I've got my some of my circuits drawn out here. You can see I've spent some time trying to figure out the layouts and how everything's gonna go. So I'm getting ready to start work on this. I'm getting ready to install my power power windows and door poppers. So first thing I did is I'm laying down a nice little half inch piece of this foam similar to what was inside of here. It builds it all the way up. So I'm gonna put a half inch piece down first. I'm gonna build a little box over here. This is a good place to start because this is really the only place there is uh, to put this equipment other than inside the console. And if I put it inside the console, that'll work, but it might be a nightmare if I have to ever have to take anything apart. So what I want to do is I want to put it over here. This is a completely open and unrestricted area. I'm going to put all of my devices in here to control the windows and the door poppers. And then I'll cover all this up with the plate. and It'll all be down in here. This is easier to access. I can just pull this plate up and I can get in here if I have to. So foam goes down first, and I'm gonna build myself a little piece of wood to fit in here so that everything can mount to it. Okay, this is my control panel for my windows and door poppers. That's one window drive unit, that's the other window. Uh, that's like a the driver popper, pop the door. This is a popper for the door on the passenger side. And I've got the, the thing that flashes the lights for the RF controller and ignition cutoff all right on this little board. It fits right in here. Just like that. Now that'll be down inside there with that panel on top of it. All I gotta do is wire it up.